All right, everybody, welcome back. This is another break. My name's Greg. I'm from Canada. Thanks for tuning in. Um, couldn't find any 23, 24 Upper Deck Series 2 because they were all sold out. So I'm doing a bunch of random breaks today. 2021 Hockey 10 Series 2 uh, and a box uh, that I already made videos on. And then we got the extended. Um, we did a little box of those as well as now we're going to do 21, 22 Series 1 box uh, break for you guys right now. Hopefully you guys are enjoying. If you do, give a thumbs up. Like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Let me know what you guys would like to see me break open um, besides what I'm doing tonight. And leave some positive feedback or negative feedback. It's all uh, it's all good. I am new. This is only my first day recording videos, breaking hockey cards. I haven't collected since the 90s. But uh, that Connor Bedard rush that is hitting the world right now. Um, the hype is there, so I decided to get a little bit back into the hobby, so we're doing some random breaks tonight. Hopefully you guys are enjoying it, but right now let's get into it. 2021-22 NHL Upper Deck Series 1. It says 9 packs plus a bonus pack. And again, look for the Young Guns, same as the other three that I've opened. So let's get into it. like unwrapping a little Christmas present of hockey card awesomeness, hopefully. So let's see what this guy has. So it should be 10 packs. Nine plus a bonus, okay, and there's the bonus. 1984-95 rookie die cast for this one. So we'll put him out of the way. Put the garbage in there. And we'll open lucky number seven first. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then we'll open number three. And then we'll open number five. And then we'll open the last one. And then these ones we'll repick through. Okay. First card. Let's see how we do in this pack. And it wants to be stubborn off the bat. Okay, upper deck. Okay, just some filler, no household names. Okay. A Braden Holtby canvas. That'll be our first hit of our first pack. Braden Holtby canvas. Sergey Bobrovsky, okay. And just some base cards. Nothing special other than the canvas. So we'll give him a sleeve. Braden Holby canvas for the Vancouver Canucks. These little sleeves are so difficult sometimes. There we go. And again, Vancouver Canuck, Brayton Holt v. Canvas. And it says C79. So I don't know how good that one is. We'll have to look at it later. All right. Second pack, and I chose pack number three. Wow, what is with these ones? Wow, they're really stubborn to open for some reason. Not like the other ones. I'm just going to give it a little sniff. J. 
Jeebus, folks. Jeebus. Lars Eller. Franco, Nico Heischer. Nick Suzuki. Dazzler. Very nice. A blue Dazzler Suzuki for the Montreal Canadiens. That's a pretty card. We got just filler. Shea Theodore, nothing special, no household names. Joel Edmondson, nothing special other than the Lars Eller, but I feel like that's just a base card. So the Blue Dazzler, Nick Suzuki, that'll be our hit to go with the canvas of Holpe. There we go again. Blue Dazzler. Some shiny. Looks pretty cool. Put him up there. Alright, third pack. And again, it wants to be stubborn and not want to open along the glue. What in the heck, upper deck? Okay. I guess you're getting a little snip snip as well. Right along the top, right down the middle. <laughs> That's three packs now. This is the third pack that was a little bit of a shite to open. Maybe there's something cool in here. Uh, Jordan Stahl for the Carolina Hurricanes. Household name. We got Seth Jones for the uh, Columbus Blue Jackets. Josh Anderson. Okay, we got a Young Guns. Joe Valeno. Our first Young Guns pulled for the Detroit Red Wings. Really nice card. Adam Henrique. And Claude Giroux. Claude Giroux. He's having a pretty rough season this year with Philly. I thought Philly was going to do a lot better the way they came out swinging at the beginning of the season just to choke near the end. But uh, Claude Giroux base card. Pack number four. And it also, I'm, I'm just going to cut every single one of these at the top because that's the fourth pack that did not want to open nicely. I don't want to damage a card just in case. So give her a little snip. And it still doesn't want to open. Are you kidding me? Okay, we'll give it another little snip. Open her up right down the middle. Like so. Matthew uh, Tachuk or Matthew Kachuk. Connor McDavid, there we go. We got a McDavid card, a Kachuk card. Kachuk is still with the Calgary Flames. Cool little base card of Kachuk. Cool base of Connor McDavid. That'll go with the Leon Dreisaitl that we got earlier. A little Connor base, okay, okay. Oh, okay. That's a really cool card. Show that in a second. Uh, just base. We got an honor roll card. The lighting is crap in here. For the Mighty Ducks. Can't even read that name right now. It's so dark back here. But Mighty Ducks Honor Roll. So that'll be our hit out of the pack for a special insert one, I guess. But then we're going to put McDavid in there.
just as a nice base card because it's a McDavid. It's our first McDavid out of everything that we've opened so far on the channel tonight. And then we'll put the Tachuk, the Matthew Tachuk. We'll put him over here off to the side and I'll check that out. Because if it's just a base card, I'm not going to waste a sleeve on it. Um, then we'll go three from the top. We'll grab this one. And we're going to give him a little snipperoo as well because these packs have been total shite to open along the seam tonight. This is the only this is the only box that I've had a problem with. All the other ones just open nice. So maybe that's a sign that there's gonna be some gold in here. Because <laughs> they're so hard to open. I don't know. Wishful thinking, folks. Okay. Uh, Oliver Larson. Brad Michant. Yeah. Uh, he put a little bit of a hurting on my Leafs tonight in game one. Oh, we, first Sidney Crosby card. That'll go good with the Ovechkin and the dry saddle and the McDavid. Uh, Carrie Hart. Oh, what is this? A hundred percent Hundo P. Mark Stone. And it's an HP. One one. Mark Stone, that is a really cool card with the Hundos. So that'll be our hit to go with the Sidney Crosby and the Brad Marchant. And just some filler. So put them there. That is a really cool card though. Mark Stone for the Vegas Knights. A hundo. And then we'll put the Sidney Crosby in a penny sleeve to go with the Connor. Base. And Marchant. I'm not even going to put Marchant in there. Like It might be a 50 cent card. Maybe a dollar. I don't know. Maybe not even that. Um, we're going to put him with, uh, with the Chuck. We'll check him out later. There might be some value there, but I don't know because, like I said, I haven't collected um, any NHL cards since the, the 90s, early 90s. So I don't know what's what. I just know some of the inserts. Um, and then we'll go three from the top again. I just know some of the inserts are cool. And then, obviously, you want Dreisaitl, McDavid, Nylander, Matthews, Tavares. Because I'm a Leafs fan, I want all the Leafs. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, it's pretty much just the inserts and the, uh, the young guns, rookies that, that have a penny to them. Everything else is usually just filler, but I could be wrong. Cause like I said, I haven't been in the hobby for a really long time now, but, uh, leave a comment and let me know what I should be looking for other than the, uh, the young guns and the dazzlers and the canvas. And I guess the hundos in this series. But like I said, that might not even be a good card. It might just be might just be something different. And I'm putting it in a sleeve for no reason. But like I said, I don't know yet. It'll take me a little while to get back into the hobby. But uh, Ethan Bear for the Edmonton Oilers. Johnny Goudreau in a Calgary uniform still. Ooh, Young Guns. Philip Gustafson for the Ottawa Senators. Hey, and right behind our Young Guns goalie for Ottawa, we got our first Toronto Maple Leaf. Whoa, back-to-back -back Leafs, get out of here. Let's go. Right after our Young Guns, we got back-to-back -back Leafs. We've got eh, TJ Brody not having the greatest season. He's been a healthy scratch a lot. Had a rough game the other night. And then we've got Justin Hall. Justin Hall. Two more Leafs to add to the collection. Doesn't matter if they're a penny. Um, they're going to get a sleeve to go to the Leafs. And then we got Jeff Carter and Jeff Petrie. So I feel like that's all just filler, but it is cool. Ethan Bear, household name. Johnny Goudreau, household name. Uh, this flip guy for Detroit, don't know. Jeff Carter's a household name. 
and Jeff Petrie for the Montreal Canadiens, also a household name. But Flip Gustafson for our second Young Guns of this case. I don't know how well of a Young Gun he is in this series, but... Uh, We got him nevertheless. So two young guns so far, a goalie and a Detroit. And then our two Toronto Maple Leafs. You guys get a penny sleeve. And then you'll go in the binder later. But two more leafers to add to the collection. We'll put them right up top. So we got a Matthews in the last series uh, for series two. We got a Matthews, and now we got a Brody and a Hall for our Leafs collection. And we're just gonna take that top one. for an L.A. King. Dustin Brown canvas. Okay. Oh, what is that? Oh, is it two cards stuck together? No. It is a debut coming up next, and it's a thick one. I thought this pack felt a little heavier. Um, so, yeah, we've got a Dustin Brown canvas. This card looks pretty cool. Up next, we've got a debut date. I don't know if these are rare cards or what, but uh, it's got a jersey, a little piece of a jersey, and it's Peyton Krebs for the Vegas Knights. So that is a canvas. You can go with this guy, the Gowley. But yeah, what a cool card. And it's DD14, debut date, Peyton Eyes. And it's got a little piece of his jersey there. That is a really cool card. No autograph or anything like that on it, but that is really cool. You're getting a sleeve. in your home. Oh my goodness. Do I need a thicker sleeve for these guys? This dude just does not want to go in his home. I don't want to mess up the card. Hmm. The one side wants to go in, but the other side does not. So, that guy is going to go up here. But yeah, it's a jersey card. Debut dates. Peyton Nyes. Or Peyton Kress, Krebs. We're just going to put him up there for now. I'll put him in a special case. Really cool card, though. Really cool. I thought it was a card stuck together because it was so thick. That's my first one of those. Um. Uh, Nothing special, just filler. Okay, that was really cool. Yeah, we'll take the bottom one and leave the top one for last. Andre Vasilevsky. Hey, we got Jack Campbell in a Toronto Maple Leafs uniform. He's no longer with us, but he's going to get a Leafs spot. Uh, the Vasilevsky can go over here just because he's one of the best goalies in the NHL this year. Uh, Brendan Gallagher. A lot of Montreal's. Ooh, what is this? 
Another UD portrait. Cole Caulfield. Montreal Canadian. That is really cool. You are going to get a sleeve. Charlie McAvoy. Jake Getzel traded. And Kevin Hayes. Charlie McAvoy. Jake Getzel. Back to back Pittsburgh Penguins. But Getzel is now with Carolina. Okay. So our first goalie, we got Mr. Jack. He's no longer with the Leafs. But we'll take him and add him to the Leafs binder. Fit in your sleeve. What is wrong with these? There we go. Get in there. Three Leafs. Oh, yes. And the Cole Cotfield UD portrait. Is it a numbered one? Uh, P40. So, portrait 40. Caulfield portrait. It says rookies on the back. Is this Caulfield's rookie season? No. Maybe. I don't think so. We're going to have to check that one out. That might be a special one. Um, canvas is our first portrait. Canvas, canvas. Yeah, our first portrait, but we'll put them with the two canvas cards. Because it's not a shiny, he's not a Toronto Maple Leaf. He is a household name, but he's a special one. Yeah, we'll put him over there. All right, last pack, and then we've got the special pack to open up. What could be in here? We got a portrait, we got two canvases, we've got a blue dazzle Nick Suzuki. We got that honor roll, um, two young guns, and the hundo card. And then three Toronto Maple Leafs. So last pack before the bonus pack. Justin Schultz, Gibson. Oh, what is this? Patrick Line, Magentic? That's got to be the hit card. That is cool. Sebastian Ajo for filler. On the base, Daniel Nurse again. And nothing special there. Wow, what a cool card. It's rainbow. Look at this. Really cool. And it is a EM25 Patrick Line A Electric Magentic. Look at the color on that. Look at that. That is really cool. Wow, what a good series to open. 2021 Upper Deck Series 1. Pulling through. We got... This really cool card, Patrick Line. We got the Nick Suzuki Blue Dazzler. The Patrick Line. We got the Hundo. For Mark Stone. We got the Honor Roll. I can't read his name. The lighting is shit in here. It doesn't look like the lighting is shit, but the lighting is shit. You got this guy for honor roll card for the Mighty Ducks. Pretty cool. I think that one goes first. And then the Cole Cotfield portrait rookie. It says rookie on the back, but I don't know. It says rookies. So we'll put him... Probably in between the Dazzler and the Hundo. And then we got two canvases. We got a Holtby canvas and a Dustin Brown canvas. There's the Dustin Brown for the Kings canvas. And then we got the Holtby goaltender canvas. 
with a couple Canucks in the background there. And we got two young guns, a goalie for the Ottawa Senators, for the young guns. And then we got a Detroit Red Wing, young guns. And then we got three Maple Leafs, Justin Hall, TJ Brody, and then Jack. Captain Jack for our Toronto Maple Leaf collection. And then we got the Connor Bedard, or no, Connor McDavid, not Bedard, wrong set. Connor McDavid base. And then we got a Sidney Crosby base. What a really cool set to pull. Oh, and then we got this crazy one that didn't fit in the sleeve. And that was the debut date. Um, Vegas Knight Peyton Krebs. And it's got the little piece of the jersey. It's a thick card. I thought it was a card stuck behind it. But really cool. So, yeah. And then we got another Vasileski base, a Marchant base, and a Tachuk base. Um, that I'll look up and see if they're anything to sleeve or they're just random base cards. But overall, that was a really, really cool box to rip. I got a lot of cool cards. Not too shabby to start the collection of the newer upper deck. Now we got the uh, exclusive 94.95 rookie die cut. So I already opened a pack of this earlier in one of the other boxes that I had. And I got a red and two gold die cuts. But nobody that I recognized. So hopefully we get a household name here. Somebody I've heard of. And if not, it just goes with the other die cut rookies as these are kind of cool. But make sure if you guys have seen me call out something or seen something and it's something special, uh, let me know. It's three gold die cuts. We got a goalie for the Buffalo Sabres. Gold die cut. And a sleeve. We got another goalie. What the heck? Die cut for the Florida Panthers. And we got Shane Pence. Shane Pence for the Ottawa Senators. Gold die cut. So three gold. So I feel like the gold is the most common in the die cuts. Because I've got five of them out of six now. I've got five gold and one red. But die cut rookies nonetheless. So they get a sleeve, even knowing I've never heard of these three players. But we'll take it. So all in all, that was a really cool box to rip. Um, these videos probably won't be posted until tomorrow. But uh, yeah, that was a really fun box to rip. 2021-22 Series 1 Upper Deck. That's some really cool things. How cool, I don't know until I look some of them up. But uh, thank you very much for tuning in to my video. And love and respect from Canada. I hope everybody has a good evening. And I've got one more short video to make. And that'll be on deck next. And it is going to be... 22-23 Series 1 Upper Deck. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, positive, negative feedback. Let me know what I could be doing better or what you guys would like to see me rip. Or if you guys heard me call out a card for this series and it was a good one and I just threw it in the random base pile. Uh, let me know and let me know what I should be looking for because I'm going to get a couple boxes of each of this stuff again um, to rip because I might as well go for collections and full sets. But love and respect from Canada. Thank you very much for watching my video. Have a great night. Go Leafs go. Cheers.